We absolutely love this campground. It is really relaxing, beautiful trees, and we're gonna do a late weekend brunch. I'm making gluten-free waffles, brats, and eggs. I'm gonna let the brats boil, get my waffle batter started, and get set up. It's gonna be a nice and relaxing weekend. I go in the RV, I come out, and this is what I find. There's Joe, eating a brat. I haven't even gotten the waffles started. And poor Leo didn't even get a piece. I saved the piece for you. Does Leo get a piece? Sure. Come here, bud. What do you have to say for yourself? It's good. They're pro cooked perfectly. You were taste testing? Uh huh. The only way to taste test the sausage is to go from one end to the other. All right. I've got my gluten-free waffle batter. The waffle iron is heating. The brats are done. There's only four left. That's okay. They're safe in Joe's belly. Leo's waiting for more sausage. Got the waffle and the iron. I'm gonna fry up two eggs for Joe, sunny side up style, and we'll be ready for brunch. I have to say, I love this Coleman stove. I grew up camping with this thing. My dad's had it for, I don't even know how long, but he gifted it to us when we got on the road. This is one of my favorite things to have when we're at a campground and the weather is nice and we can cook outside. Leo and I are definitely excited for breakfast. Right, buddy? Right? love Belgian waffles. At one point I actually wanted to start a waffle business. And I've had this waffle iron for over 10 years and it's the best waffle iron I've ever had. Yum. Okay. I love egg yolk on my waffle. Man, this is good. Mmm. Crispy waffle. Saltiness from the sausage and the egg and the sweet maple syrup is my favorite. Leo. Hey bud. Don't worry, you'll get some. Good boy. really nice out so I figured why not actually very easy to take on and off just another reason why we went with the Jeep so take out two screws there is a plug under here undo that plug undo the strap One down, one more to go. And you know, we can actually take the window and you can lay it down. You wanna do that? No, cause we don't have a strap to hold it. Want me to hold the screws? Sure. You know, there are times I wish we had gotten the uh, convertible, but I think overall the hard top is a better, it's a better choice. Since we are at a public campground, Joe went ahead and <laughs> secured the doors to our spare tire carrier. I think we'll be good. Um, so we're legal. I'm putting my homemade mirror on. These are not the best tools for the job, but they were what was in front. Should be good enough. All right. Ready to go? I'm ready to go. All right, let's do it. We've got the roof off, the doors off. Leo, don't look so upset. You just had a delicious lunch. He does look kind of upset. <laughs> What's going on?
going on, bud? Mm. So free, so open. Hey, Leo. He's still not looking too happy. What's up, bud? We decided to drive down to downtown Racine uh -huh. and found Lake Michigan. There are a lot of people out sailing today. Kind of makes me wish we had a sailboat. I know. But we've got the Jeep. <laughs> now we're going to take Leo for a little bit of a walk and see what trouble we can get into. Joe's making dinner. We're having steak salad. Actually, no, we're having steak with peppers and mushrooms. And more importantly, we've got wine. He never misses a beat. Nope. How's our dinner looking? Excellent. Look at him. He's like, Dad, please, can I have a piece of steak? Oh, he's got a friend. 